Hello, I'm Callie Lichter. More public universities and colleges are opposing Senate Bill 202, which would change tenure and leadership on campus. Further, we don't know what remedies the Commission will be able to provide. Will they be able to make employment termination decisions, student discipline decisions? IU President Pamela Witten says that her concern is the unintended consequences that threaten not only the university, but the economy and culture of the state. Ball State officials asked lawmakers to strike parts of the bill that would impose changes on university boards of trustees. A spokesperson says Purdue University is still, quote, working to fully understand the details of the bill. A Senate committee passed a bill this week that would fund additional scholarships for school employees with non-teaching degrees. Lawmakers hope the expansion will encourage more people to transition to teaching from other careers. The Transition to Teaching program provides scholarships of up to $10,000 to school employees who have bachelor's degrees in other fields. And a winter weather advisory remains in place for much of Indiana, with southern Indiana expected to get as much as four inches of snow. INDOT will have more than 500 trucks treating state highways, interstates, and U.S. routes. The expected accumulation caused Monroe County and other area schools to let out early this afternoon. All after-school events were also canceled. Cold wind chills as low as zero degrees are possible Saturday morning. Now let's take a look at the weather. More of it. Tonight, an 80% chance of snow showers is continuing on with a low of 18 degrees. And looking at towards our five-day forecast, the snow will cease with sunny skies for the next five days with temperatures hitting 60 by Wednesday. For more local news, go to WTIUnews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6.